duel. Draw. I'll activate Shadow Fusion, sending Shadow Falco and White Dragon Wife Buster to Fusion Summon. L Shadow Construct. Shadow Falco's effect goes off, and so does Constructs. So I'll send Shadow Squamata to the grave, and Falco sets itself. Now Squamata's effect sends Shadow Beast to the grave. And Beast's effect lets me draw a card. I'll set a card. And it's your move, Onomatopoeia. Draw! First, I'll activate Vampire Kingdom. Then, call up the mummy. And use its effect to summon Yuna Zombie. Then Yuna Zombie's effect Send Vampire Graves to the graveyard. But then I'll tribute Yuna Zombie to summon Shadow Vampire. And use its effect, summoning Vampire Duke from the deck. And now Vampire Grace's effect to summon itself from the grave. Now I'll use Vampire Grace's other effect forcing you to send a spell from your deck to the grave. So what'll it be? I'll send El Shadow Fusion to the grave. That activates Vampire Kingdom's effect. I send a vampire to the grave and destroy one card you control. Bye-bye, Construct. Construct's effect gets back Shadow Fusion from the grave. And now I'll attack. Shadow Falco flips, and now for its effect, setting Shadow Beast from the grave. Next, I'll overlay Duke and Shadow to a series summon Crimson Knight Vampire Bram, and its effect summons your Shadow Falco to my side of the field. Can you guess what happens next? I'll seek Falco with Grace to Synchro Summon Beals of the Diabolic Dragons. Nothing can destroy Beals. Have fun dealing with that. I'll set a card, and it's your move. Draw. First, I'll flip summon Shadow Beast. And that triggers its effect. So I'll draw two cards and send Shadow Hedgehog to the grave. Now Hedgehog, fetching Shadow Beast from the deck. And now I'll activate the field spell Curse of the Shadow Prison. Curse the what? You'll see this card in action soon enough. But first, I'll use my trap Shadow Core which summons itself. Next, Shadow Fusion, sending Shadow Core to the grave and Shadow Dragon from my deck to summon, once again, El Shadow Construct. Curse of the Shadow Prison gains two Spellstone counters. Vampire Kingdom goes off, so I'll destroy Construct. Nice try, but Shadow Dragon will destroy Vampire Kingdom first. But before that, Shadow Core's effect and Construct's effect. Construct sends Squamata to the grave. Core gets back El Shadow Fusion. And now Kingdom's destroyed. Now Squamata's effect, sending Shadow Falco to the grave. Falco sets itself. 
And now, I'll use El Shadal Fusion, sending Shadal Beast. And by removing three Spellstone counters from my field spell, I'll send your Beals. What? And I'll summon El Shadal Winda. I'll attack. I don't think so. I'll use my trap, Vampire Takeover, and activate Vampire Kingdom straight from the deck. And Vampire Duke summoned from the graveyard. And now for Duke's effect. You send a spell from your deck to the grave. I'll send Nef Shadow Fusion. Now Kingdom's effect. I send a vampire and constructs destroyed. Constructs effect gets back Shadow Fusion. Winda attacks Vampire Duke. I'll set two cards face down. As long as Winda's on the field, only one special summon's allowed per turn. Big deal. I'll crush you on my next turn. Oh, I doubt that. It's your move, Onomatopoeia.